Hi, this is Judy Miller, and on this recording I'm going to show you how to put an Infusionsoft web form on your WordPress website. And it's in yellow right there. It's easy. So if it's in writing, that means it has to be true. Let me show you how to do it. First, you need to go inside your Infusionsoft application and actually create that web form. So if I hover over the Infusionsoft logo, and I come into the Campaign Builder, I've already created one for sake of time, and it's under Get My Newsletter. Once I come into this campaign, you'll see that I have a web form right here, and that web form is the web form that I'm going to use. And even though I don't have anything else published in this campaign, I do have my web form published, and the way I can tell is that that form is bright emerald green, and that means it's published. Once you publish your web form, and it does have to be published in order to use it, I'm going to double-click on the form, and once I double-click in the form, I'm going to go into the code section. When I click on the code section, I'm going to come into the do-it-yourself section right here. The do-it-yourself section, I have the opportunity to use JavaScript, HTML, or HTML unstyled. If I use the HTML snippet, if I make any changes on this form inside Infusionsoft, I'm going to have to republish it and take that code and put it back on my website. But if I use the JavaScript snippet, and I make a change inside the Infusionsoft web form, as soon as I publish it, it's going to mirror those exact changes that I made. Sometimes a JavaScript snippet does not work very well with your WordPress theme, so make sure you test it out. I'm going to use a JavaScript snippet here and show you how to do that. So I click on JavaScript snippet. I copy the code. And then I open up my website. When you open up your website, you land on your dashboard and you get to decide, being an admin, what page you want it on. Well, I'm going to come down to Appearance, and when I'm on Appearance, I'm going to come down to Widgets. And if I click on the Widgets button, this screen will automatically appear, and it will show me the sidebar of my pages. Every single page is going to have this sidebar right here. In this sidebar, I would like to place my form. I want it on every single page on the side of my website page. So these are the available widgets right here. And if I look down, I want to find the one that says text or HTML. There's text right there on the bottom. And if you notice, it says arbitrary text or HTML, and that's what I want. So I'm going to grab that widget, and I'm going to drag it right in the top of this sidebar. I can put it on the bottom, but I want it to be on the top of the page and not the bottom. I can give it a title get this newsletter. And then in the content box, that's where I'm going to paste that code, as simple as that, and then I hit Save. So I bet you're wondering what it looks like on your pages. So what I'm going to do is, in my WordPress, I'm going to come to Pages, and I'm going to click on All Pages. It's going to bring up my pages, and I can review and preview any one of these pages. I'm going to look at the one that says, You Are Here, and I'm going to hit View. And when I hit View, it's going to show me my page and then my sidebar. This sidebar will be on every single page of my website. That's the title I just made, Get This Newsletter, and this is the web form that I created inside of Infusionsoft right here. Pretty cool. So that's how you put an Infusionsoft web form on your WordPress website. It's super, super easy to do. Just remember, make sure that your form is published, grab your code, go to your admin page, and drop that code in a text box, a JavaScript box, or an HTML box. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.